Hello gamers, I'm Glory Hound and this is Dr. Glory Hog. And today we're playing Factory 42. This is by Dragon Dawn Productions. And this is a worker placement game where we're dwarves. Well, actually, do you want to discuss? Because yeah. dwarves are kind of your thing, Doctor. Oh. Realize. <laughs> it's because I dated one in high school. All what? Right, so I think she qualified. So essentially, we are a bunch of dwarves in a mountain. We all work in a factory. We are the factory manager. So she's a manager, and I am a manager. I'm gonna make a terrible manager just we have our right team. off the bat. I'm yeah. letting you know. <laughs> but this being a factory, although we have separate teams, right? You could say like day and night shift or something. We still have to work together somewhat to make sure that somewhat that we don't like explode the mountaintop or something, right? So that's essentially the idea: is that we have to kind of somewhat work together or not. It's our choice. We could blow this thing up if we wanted to get the resources, get them back here, do all these government orders because these still need to be completed if we want to go ahead and progress the game. And this is still a production copy, so not all of the stuff in this is final, but yeah, these cards are really stinking cute, right? <laughs> yeah, this is being sponsored um, by the company. And also, just so you know, this is not the how to play. If you want to have more idea of how the rules work, definitely check out Dan's preview. Uh, Absolutely. Game Boy Game's preview. This is more of a should you play. This should give you a really good idea of how the game plays. And give you an idea if this is something you want to go ahead and support on Kickstarter. And hello to our chat today. It looks like we have Petter and Battlecry and the Game Boy Geek in chat. Those final carts look so cool. Yeah. And so does the final cube tower. Oh my goodness, Which I'm so excited. The cube tower about it. is like super unique, but if we put it under the camera, the camera will just focus on the cube tower. So you'll have to check it out on the Kickstarter. Absolutely, because it will it will mess up all the camera stuff. But it's got this cool like misshaped lattice thing so that sometimes cubes get stuck right. due when, to red tape. When you draw stuff or when you throw stuff in there, sometimes stuff gets caught as it comes down. So you don't know exactly what you're going to get as you're like seeding this as you go along. Yeah. So we'll show the cube tower after we're done with the game and everything with that, where we can actually take it apart and show everyone. And this is worker placement. So here's all my little dwarves. And I think mm -hmm. in order to determine who goes first, it's the last person to have kissed a dwarf. I think it was the last person to have had a dwarven ale. 
No, I was the last person to kiss a dwarf. I'm pretty sure it's dwarven and ale. I think you are short enough <laughs> to qualify. Oh, the cube tower cam. Petter, where are you all the time? Like, we totally should have done that. It's not tall enough. No, it's not tall enough, Petter. I would have totally done that. Maybe we'll Pet do it next uh, time. towards the end. We'll, we'll tip the tower down so you can see what it looks like. Conference meet earlier, okay, Petter? <laughs> Yeah, Petter, what are you doing all day? I know you're not working. You're talking about the spaceport and everything, giving us all these great ideas. <laughs> all right, Doctor. So what you're saying is do you want to go first? No, you can go ahead and go first. Okay. I'll allow you. So first we need to go ahead and start by putting cu cubes in the common pool. So we're going to need one of the wood and then a marble in there, right? Yep, yep. To and start what that. Is our, and then we're going to have one from here, too. Oh, and every worker in requisition gains a rosette. A rosette. So, right, Rosettes are pretty cool. They're a good way to get victory points. And where's the requisition stuff? In here. So every worker in requisition is going to gain a rosette, one. which is really good because that's going to give you a lot of XP or VP. A lot of XP. Wow. <laughs> a lot of VP for the end of the game. Marbles aren't cubes. It's No, it's marble like ore. Like yeah, so even in stone. The, when the game is finally produced, it's going to have like yeah. different size cubes. These are different size, but there's going to be even more variation between them so that the really good expensive stuff gets stuck it's more stuck often. stuck and then it's harder for it to go down. Go ahead, Dr. Delord Hog, you go ahead and go. Oh, really? I'm going to go here, which is going to be That way, whenever I win, I'm going to make sure and let you... Did you throw a beer in here for this? Oh, we no, I did not. Apologies. There we go. But we Put your beer in there. Yep. I need, like, little... We got beer, marble, and what wood? <laughs> beer, marble, and wood. <laughs> Classic. The interesting thing, too, is, like, we could potentially, like, some of this stuff burns and stuff in the tower, too, which I'm not super excited about. Our team was like, why don't you burn the beer? And I'm like, you can't really burn liquids that well. All right, I'm going to put something over here in shipping. Ooh, sneaky. You got to get in there. You got to get in there. You got to get your spot super early in the yeah, game. Yeah, I'm going to jump in on yeah, shipping Yeah, and then also. I'm going to go ahead and put some in loading and loading. Just loading. Just I'll take, I'll take steak. Not like the loading screen, but the loading docks, okay? Second fiddle there. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I'm also going to go in here for some spiking because I want to choose the firstest. I'm going to go here and get another rosette. How dare you? Bro, I'm at like, boom, another rosette. All right, I'm taking the spot here. I'm going to go here. For the requisitions. Oh, why, why are you counting? What's all this accounting going on? I'm also going to go here. I'm going to take the last accounting spot. <gasps> what? You can't do that. <laughs> I thought about it. <laughs> and I will also do one in accounting as well. And each one of these spots on here is going to go through and do something different. Go ahead. You got this, doctor. You got this. <laughs> you be the best dwarf miner. Well, I guess you're not the dwarf miner. Person, the person who tells the dwarves what to do. You've got this. Okay, beer, marble, really? and wood is not, it's not a Saturday night yet. Well, it's That's Monday, true. so. Somebody probably should go to steam generation. Otherwise, we're not going to be able to burn anything. And we're going to need steam. probably do that. I will go here out of the kindness of my heart. All right, I'm going to go over here. Ta-da! Now, they have everything, real, like, labeled perfect here. Let's see here. It's going to be the new mantra for my life. Marbles ain't cubes. <laughs> there you go. That's accurate. <laughs> yes, and absolutely. The link to this is in the description if you're interested in the game. So we actually go through here and everything's numbered like really nicely. So first we're going to go ahead and do requisitions. And you get five points to spend for the common pool that you're going to go ahead and spend. And each item has a different point value. So your flax, your steel, and your lichen are one point. Copper, wood, and mushroom are two. Marble, gold, and beer are three. And coal is four. And basically, you're seeding that tower at that time. And then you actually get a rosette for that as well. Which I grab. Which I need to grab my two rosettes for just having my people there. Yeah. So I'm looking at So it looks like for these, if we want to take the optimal route, which is going to give you the most rosettes, we need like two marble, a coal, and um, some, some copper. This one's saying that we want to have... To the steel, or no, sorry, not the steel. Uh, to the mushrooms, to the lichen, and a beer. We already have a beer in there. So I have five to spend. So I'm going to spend one, two, three. It becomes one, like, what are the chances of everything falling through there? Yeah. Like, so you do have to seed, like, quite a bit on and there. And then I get one to myself, correct? Yes. And yep. then one you can spend that you can actually put in your storage. I'm going to put one of those lichen in there. You're going to put a lichen in there? Okay. So. 
That was this worker. Now you get to do this one as well. So you have a 7 to 2 ratio. So I'm going to pick up one of these with this 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. I'm going all in on that. There. And, and in then... order to create these, you will need three steam for that one and one steam for this one. So keep that in mind, too. Uh, no, you can put steam well, in. Well, you want to make burning. sure whatever falls down here. Hey, I already sacrificed. <laughs> We're going to get our steam. <laughs> I already sacrificed burning stuff. So you should help out is what I'm saying. Listen. You should help out. I don't know how friendly of a dwarf I Requis am. Requisition me a beat. All right. I got a six and a three. How so... low? He was the limbo champion, Petter. The limbo champion of, I think it was Jamaica. Who was? He's talking about um, Fry, Bender, Futurama. He's talking about Futurama. Ooh, what should I do? This is tough. So a coal is going to be four. Jeez. Why is coal so four. much? Four. Is it really four? It is. It is. It's four. And then... But it'll give us three steam, which is good. What else should I put in there? Like two points worth here, which, let's see here, wood is two points. So I'm going to put in a coal and a wood. Better put some marbles in there, girl. Wow. You want to get that You can't marble, tell though? me. You can't tell me how to seed this. I'm just trying to help you out. Do you want to get these orders done or not? I and mean, do you want to do the three, fosters and the bento boxes? I think you do. And two more for seeding lichen. that. Lichen. Lichen. Little lichen. Lichens. She calls them lichen. Little lichen. Lichen. But they're lichens, I'm right? I'm liking this game. It's not Whoa. a lichen. It's a lichen, right? I think it's regional. I think it's a Pet regional thing? Yeah, I think Petter's from, like, from, like, um, Canada or something. <laughs> Petter, Petter's <laughs> Canadian now. In my mind, he's just drinking maple syrup. This is wood, right? Yeah. Yellow, I want to make sure that it's that. Okay, so wood is two. I'm spending for myself, and then I need, like, one more. And I think I'm going to take um, one of these little lichen, these lichen lichens. Like a lichen lichen, lichen would be like a he werewolf. Says Canada is just a bad Minnesota. Minnesota. Oh, oh, that's so messed up. All right, I've done both of mine. So I've seated in there. I've taken this here. We're going to go to two over here, which is bureaucracy. You got to watch out for red tape. I don't, I don't know, know if you have to shake here. them. They're going to get shaken up whenever you pour them in. I like mine stirred. Shake, shake, shake. You. There, now it's stirred. It's good. <laughs> Oh, very nice, very nice. I need some of those things. I need. I'm mouse, very happy. See what they are. I'm very happy. I'm gonna be doing my loading first. So whenever I'm loading here, I get to take four, one to four resources, and I get to put them in one of these little carts here. Remember, and you're actually supposed to like slide it down, but I'm just gonna put it in the cart down here. If I get hosed by your loading, I'm just gonna not burn anything. I'll just choose not to burn. So you nice. burn everything that's left in there, that's left in here. As a note, doctor. I will doctor? Not. Does that happen at the end? <laughs> I'm going to take these two resources here. And I'm going to take... Uh, what else do I want to take? What else do I want to take with me, everyone? I can take four, so I think I'm going to take those as well. The mushroom is better than the lichen, so I'm going to take these. I'm going to take two mushrooms. And this isn't mine. This is just, like, me, like, loading some goods into a little cart here. Like, everything's fine. Everything's fine. Go ahead and do your loading, doctor. Doctor? And the interesting thing about these spots here is that you have your worker spots that you place and then you have like these little like oversight spots here that do different things and can actually affect what's happening in these in the spots where you place workers which i think is really interesting what are you doing with all this business up in here uh did you just did you just make something like almost exactly like mine no mine's very different why right. did you put the coal in yours how are we gonna burn it there's wood over there <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Right. I need that coal. For what? For stuff. Okay. 
This could go badly. All right, so for spiking, then I need to draw from the spiking bag. First worker draws three resources plus one for each, additional each worker there. So four. And these are special resources. Your pronunciation is sus. <laughs> it's sus. It's sus. It's sus. Oh no, my no, it's sus because of my pronunciation of sus. Get it? I will not eat green <laughs> eggs and ham. I will not eat them with this ma'am. Good day, ma'am. Oh, goodness. Ooh, I kind of want this gold. I'm going to put this gold in here, and then I'm going to put one more item in there. What else I do I want? What else gold. do I want? Gold is exactly what happened in Lord of the Rings. You really want to collect, also, like, as, a, as a dwarf, you think you'd be do, like gold averse. Do you want a smog? This is how you get smog, is by collecting gold. I'm going to take this coal. No, I already have enough coal. Should I take a coal too? No, I'm going to take, I'm going to take the copper. I'm going to take the copper. And then you are not spiking the bags. So that goes back in there. Is it the only, you only put out two? Yes. Draw three horses plus one. <gasps> Oh, man, so I'm not going to even get anything then, am I? On to shipping! <laughs> so I'm now I'm going to go ahead and ship out my little cart. Do, 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 to the dock. I can still ship, because it just says must ship out one of the, the two at the station. So just get, get, your, a, get your ship on. I'll just get like a lot less Get resources. your ship on. We got two docks here, so like if I wanted to put another point into another worker here for manufacturing too, I could do it like twice. All right, so now we've done shipping. Now just follow the numbers five, six, steam generation, steam generation, burn all burnable resources in the common pool. So, what do we have here? We can't we got burn some wood. beer, we got just wood, and then we got some licking, some little lichens. So that's what one, two. So, wood is two steam per that's steel. The little lichens, one steam per. So two, four, five. Okay, five. So we have, we now things are all steamy. Now that things are all steamy in here. And then it says, worker may burn any additional resources from their personal supply and receive run rosette for the effort. Okay, so I don't actually have any. So that probably was a wasted spot, which just proves that I have bad project management. <laughs> On the seven. Shipping your stew and cart to the dock? No, I'm shipping my cart to myself because all, that's where all the good stuff is. Hi, Timo. How are you doing? All right, so seven will be trading, which we don't have anybody who wants to trade, which this changes every round, which is interesting. Eight is research actually on our boards here, which we both don't have anybody there. Nine is going to be <coughs> the manufacturing. So I would go so first. So you get to go first. Not that it super matters here, but I'm going to go ahead and do... That one there. So I'm gonna do. You're gonna do the bento boxes. Yeah, I'm gonna make bento boxes. So I've got. You're making dwarven bento boxes. Two mushrooms. Hold yeah. on. And then a so they get they get a big thing of beer, <laughs> two mushrooms, and then some some lichen to eat. All right, so I've got those. You just made a mushroom little lichen beer bento box. How do they put the beer so in I there? So I completed that one, and so I get uh, three rosettes. That's very nice. And it's I did the optimal. minus three steam though. One, two, three. Yeah. All right. What are you going to do? I'm going to put this in my warehouse. I'm definitely going to build that other thing. The other thing with the stuff. All right. But you got like three rosettes on that. That's a lot of rosettes. I feel like you're already getting way too many rosettes than you should be getting, doctor. I am not happy about that at all. So I'm going to go ahead and do the posters. I got to make these posters. All right, everyone. Is Dwarves, there's beer and everything. <laughs> That's fair. I'm just saying, I want to see the real version of this dwarven bento box, okay? That's all I'm saying. So my optimal poster manufacturing... About half of it's just beer. ...will be two marble, because I'm making, like... I'm making marble posters? Those are going to be hard to mount on the wall. <laughs> Maybe I make them directly on the wall. What do you think, Doctor? Okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and put a wood in there. Yeah, that's pretty standard. I mean, marble standard posters. wood, coal, and and marble posters. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and spend those. Maybe you're a poster. Then you don't know. Wow, and then I'm gonna spend the one steam right here, and I'm going to make those. To do so, I get my two rosettes. We did a really good job. We knocked out all the government orders together, like a team, right? <laughs> only, only a team for right now. 
six pack with a lichen would work, yes. There you go. <laughs> it's just the six pack with yeah. like the lichen piled there on top that, of there it. There's that beam where it's just a slice of pizza and a beer in each Tupperware, and they're like, meal prep. <laughs> For the next six days, it's like just they ordered a pizza and some beer. Oh, that's fantastic. Okay, so we so both did nine, the manufacturer. So 10, 10, which we're both accounting. on Accounting. I go first. I'm going to trade in these two to get three victory points. It's a little rosettes. So you get to do yep. two of these, but you can't do the same thing twice. Right, right, right. So I could. So you turn in two rosettes to get three victory points, but you can also spend, so you can bribe the committee with, what is that, golden beer? Or marble yeah. for a victory point. You can or you already exploited your fame. You can call I'm in a favor. Call in a favor also. <gasps> and you're gonna call in a favor? Another victory point. Wow. I'm breaking 42, baby. Let's do this. All right. So what are you gonna do? I'm also gonna exploit my fame. Okay. Listen, my posters were like top notch. I am Getting such recognition in the land for these posters, y'all don't even know, okay? Y'all don't even you know. Y'all don't even know. <laughs> One, two, three. Up there. And do I have anything good for bribes? I do have gold. Should I bribe the committee with some gold? I feel I like know. that's a thing. I feel like I should do that thing. Let's let's do it. Let's bribe the committee. Get out of here, doctor. All right. Ten. Eleven. Another manufacturing here. Right. And then 12. End and of then round. 12. End of round. It's empty carts. Return. I have an empty cart. I can move these to my storage if I would like. However, I only have the one standard storage right here right now. So I'm actually going to have to keep this cart here. Otherwise, I'm going to lose resources on my next turn. So I'm keeping that there. That's why I have two loading docks right here, everyone. Okay. <laughs> Cue the deliverance music. Wow. Southern dwarfs. Oh my goodness. Okay, so are you gonna finish reading it? Oh, I didn't even start. So return empty carts to the station. Government orders two VP for each government order completed. Negative one VP or negative two for each player for every government order not completed. So we completed all government orders, but we're both gonna gain two VP. So we're all up at six. We're all up at six. Award Hero of Labor for player who completed the most government actions. All tied get one rosette. Give me my rosettes. Maybe I should have spent a rosette. Maybe the rosettes would have been better. Change the inventor guild. Okay, so that'd be if there was additional things. Because there is an actual more advanced mode, too. This is the... Yeah, this is the base games where you so, kind of get, learn how the game works. You go through all of the different aspects of it and how it's played. And then there's other cards and things that you can add to this game. So this game can actually get, can get technically harder. <laughs> Much harder to play. So we've got ourselves uh, a new event. We've got ourselves some new government orders here. Everybody got their rosettes. We go ahead and pull our people back. Your people have to stay, though. No, I don't want, I don't now want to. Now you get to place first. Now I what don't about want to. these extra resources from the pool that doesn't burn? stay there? They stay in the common pool? Yeah, put them in the common pool, and then we're going to add, start adding to the common pool. Well, they, they don't get run through again, do they? They would stay there, put them I think. In they wouldn't. Why would they get run through again? Right, They've so, already made it through. Let's see here. At the end of the round, each commissar must play, pay one resource to the common pool or lose a ros rosette. Nice. What? But it starts us off with a beer? It does. And then we get... So at the end of the round, each commissar must pay one resource to the common pool. And wood. Off of this. So we got to make a heroic statue and a feast buffet. What is this? Are you going to take care of the feast buffet and I'll do the heroic statue? No, maybe I want the feast buffet. Oh my gosh. <laughs> take a look and see. At 42 points, the game ends for a phenomenal victory. I have not managed to do that even after quite some games. I can't imagine. We did not get up. We did not even get close to 42 either. <laughs> that did not happen for us. So if you want to do the feast buffet, you need to have two different types of food and also the marble. If you want to do the heroic statue, you can have three marble and a gold. Well, I mean, if you're looking at the most optimal ones, or you could do two wood instead. So there's some different options there. 42 is also a very special number. So I'm banking for the factory becoming self-aware. Then it becomes a wear factory, okay? <laughs> All right, you get to go first. What is your pleasure? I would like to. Do the shippings. 
I'm gonna do the spiking. How dare you? <laughs> oh yeah, well I'm gonna do the loading. I'm gonna do the spiking again. Oh no, doctor. I'm gonna do some loading. Ah, uh, okay. I don't know what you're gonna do. What am I gonna do? I don't think you know what I'm gonna do. I do actually. I don't. I don't like how you're talking to me. <laughs> that. <laughs> I like spiking, but I also think that the Commissar adds four resources of any choice to the spiking bag, which can also be really good. What do we need? Lots of marble. Lots and lots of marble. I don't know if the heroic statue is going to get made. Like, that's going to be hard to make. I just spent all that marble last round, you know? I don't know. Tell me about well, it. Well, I'm letting you know. I'm letting you know. Tell me how. Okay, I got that. I, got, I'm, I guess I'm going to do the spiking as well. I would like to do, let's do accounting. Yeah. Like in the purple mushrooms and the dark beer. I'm going to do some accounting also. Why are you like this? <laughs> I'm going to do my manufacturing. I'm just doing some manufacturing. Nothing to see here. We're also going to need some, like, steam. We're going to need a little bit of steam as well. Yeah, well, that would help if somebody adds some coal to the common pool. That would be great. <laughs> I don't want to name any names, but somebody should probably do that. Uh, you know what? I'll help by adding some coal. I'll add some coal. I think okay? I, I, think I like, have to ship. Otherwise, I'm pretty sure you're not going to send it my way. What? Just what? guessing. What? No. Just guessing. All right, so no. let's go. So I get a rosette. We're not going to make anything because we don't, don't have. Know. You don't know. I can make stuff. You don't. We I... don't have the things for the stuff. <laughs> so. We're going to take negative points. This is not going to be good. <laughs> this is not going to be good at all. And so I'm going to go ahead and so five, right? So I can take one of these if I wanted to. Is it, which one is the white one? That was the marble. No, because the, the white one is the wood. Oh, this is this is flax. The flax. There this is go. wood. Yeah, so this is flax down here in wood. Yeah. This bottom one. So. But that's marble. That's the marble one. Right. Right on that one. No. So I'm gonna take three, four, five. I already put one in my stuff. Sure go. I love rosettes. The friend scavenate. Scandinavian treat. I have never had a rosette that I can think of. I don't think so. Okay, it's my turn. Yeah, so you need to put seven. Seven in. and two. All right, so we're gonna put a colon. So that's four. And that's five, six, seven for that one there. And I need two for myself. I don't want. I don't want to. How about that? <laughs> Yikes. This is not helpful. I guess I will take some. Uh, I'll take some wood, I guess. Do I have wood already? I don't. Okay. For two. Okay. You said coal is four? Coal is four. Why is coal so expensive? Fried pictures coming to Discord. Thank you. I'm going to look at those, and if it looks delicious, I'm just going to make them at home. Hopefully, there's some good recipes out there. And then for myself, I can take three. I think I'm going to take... We're, like, super huge fans of any sort of foreign food at all. Like, I'm super into, like, making different cultures, foods. All right, five for you, and then three for your personal. Okay, so I think I need to take... Um, piece of marble just in case just in case and then that's for myself and then five that I can spend on some other stuff so I put coal in there probably throw some more wood and some more I mean that way we can at least burn some stuff right it's like you want to burn things but you don't want the fire to get out of control 
Okay. That'll be fun. <gasps> Battle Cry, I did. Oh my gosh, I was going to talk about that. It's amazing. Oh yeah. She's oh my eating, gosh, it's amazing. Because I've been eating candy corn and peanuts every single day every since day, the last time I you mentioned it. I pour myself just a little bit of it and it's so delicious. It's so little good. Little bit of it. So, how dare you? <laughs> a little bit of it. How dare you? Okay. It's so tiny, I have to grab it by the paw pole. How? Listen. Hey, listen. <laughs> what are you going to put in there? I don't want to put too much wood. If too much wood comes out and coal, like we're going to get overdone because there's, if, if, right now, if the wood and the coal came out here, because wood is two, right? So that's four, I'm sorry, this is three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That rockets us up to here. We don't want to rupture. We won't. Because you can always just take a coal also if you're really that worried about it after seeing it, you know? Okay, that's fair. And then I'm going to put in a wood to... And then, I'm going to put another one of these. Ba doops. All right. So, bureaucracy, let's see what kind of red tape there dun, is. Dun, 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 dun. How nicely cooperative play so far. <laughs> Never happens in our games, but I guess we'll see soon either resources missing or steam missing. Yeah, no, I can see that happening here once we get to uh, some of the later steps in this turn. <laughs> oh, wow. Look at all these marbles that came out. You've made all those jokes about marbles, and it's Marble City. I need those. <laughs> what are you going to do? Are you going to share marbles? Uh, no. I mean, yes. Wait. Maybe. Ooh, magic came out, too. What? Wow. That's going to be really good for whoever decided to load first. <clears throat> you. <laughs> all right. So go ahead and load it up. Loading up Making some me resources. Sad. Loading up some resources. We need some of these. And should I take like three coal or three marble? Should I take three marble and a magic? That's helpful, right? Mm-hmm. That is actually yeah, very helpful. Yeah. All right. Loading, loading, loading. All right. Not happy. What? Not Happy. All right, so wait a minute. What? Wait a tick. What? What just happened? <gasps> Where'd all of our food go? We put food in there. <laughs> Where did it go? <laughs> no mushrooms came? There's no mushrooms? There's no mushrooms. I have two mushrooms, but uh, no mushrooms came. Are you missing stuff? Like you can do... Uh, what? Oh. Yeah, I oh. thought mushrooms were going to come through. That's a problem. We need to... <laughs> I made such fantastical signs last time, I knew I was going to need this much marble. Okay, that's why I put extra marble in there. All right, so spiking, right? Oh, we were supposed to put something in for spiking at the end. Oh, yeah, apologies. Yes, we should have put in a flax and a lichen. And seven magic. No, not seven magic. All right, so we draw three plus one for each worker. So that's five, and then I put two out. Three, four, five. Oh, there's your mushrooms. Put a mushroom there. And what else do I want? I guess I'll take the seal. This is the interesting part, too, whenever you get your stuff, like both of... Like, I'm going to have two pieces in my dock. And I actually should have put this person probably up here if I wanted to complete, say, like, the heroic statue. Because I'm probably not going to be able to do that because this is specifically for dock two. Yeah. So I was not thinking ahead. Yeah. <laughs> and that's a problem. Yeah. No one's trading exchanging resources for what you really need. Listen, I had a plan, and then I realized that I thwarted my own plan, so... <laughs> don't come to us for tips, all right? We do not have good we tips. We don't have hot tips. <laughs> all right, so what are you going to do with your spiking? Okay. I think I would like to take... I feel like, like I'm going to need, I like, this copper or something. I actually complete I don't know. both of them, but then I kind of forgot to put a worker there. So, mistakes were made. I guess we'll do this. ba -doops. Could never have enough wood and... Hopper, so I throw, guess. Some, throw some lichen in there and stuff right now before you forget. Okay, so get our lichen and our flax. Okay. So we go down to shipping. So go ahead and ship. 
Spoilers, I'm taking this cart. I just want to, whenever I move them, I want to be like, beep, 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 beep. Sheep for wood, it was food for carbon <laughs> last time. So we get one for the lichen, and then we get two for each wood, right? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Right? I'm burning things? Yeah. Because we're, we're here, steam generation. You said two for that. And right, yeah. right, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, what is the blue? Two, four, oh, six, seven. Seven, right. So we should be at eight now. That's not too bad. I was nervous that if we were going to get out of control with that. There was a lot of coal in there, and apparently it just got all stuck. So for next time, whenever we do go ahead and fly through it. <laughs> so you go to seven, no trading. Eight, research, no. Nine would be this. I can trade in. I can trade this one in. I can trade in a lichen and a mushroom. Wait, didn't I go first? Do what you want. It does, we can both complete the thing, so. Go ahead. What do you want? All right. I need to complete this one right here. Okay. I'm going to also complete that one right there after you. So two different types of resources here. And a marble. And a marble. And they got to be, yep, we did the same thing. How dare you. So both of us are amazing. How dare you. This, we're going to get negative points, though. This was not actually a good thing. I was trying to gear up to go for that other one there, but it did not work out because I was not paying attention. Then we lose two steam because we both did it. All right, I know I should have done both. So that was nine. Then we go to ten. Ten. So go ahead. Were and you able 10. to do the other one? Oh, you could have been. Yeah, I could. Yeah. Have been. Dang it! Dang it! So many missed opportunities. All right, counting. Do your counting. Okay. So I'm gonna turn in two of my rosettes here. Four, three points. I'm gonna go up four. And then I'm gonna spend one more to go up one more point. If you could just stop following me, I'd really appreciate that, Doctor. <laughs> Shh. <laughs> okay. So we did those things, and those things happened. Cause I'll... eleven, twelve. Do we have? Okay, and then to twelve. So we're we're at the end of the round already. Go so fast. Go so fast. But I am gonna go ahead and move these into. Oh, no. Do you not have enough to do storage? I mean, I can store, but I really need to, like... I mean, this is not good. <laughs> You're okay. Because I have only one space for storage left. You're fine. No, that's not going to be helpful later on. Did we both get a rosette for being heroes? But what do we lose for not completing one of those? Negative two VP. Negative two VP or rosette, right? Or a rosette. No, it's a negative one VP, or you lose two rosettes. I'm going to lose the VP. For each oath, for each government order. Not completed. So we didn't complete one or of them. Or negative two rosettes, yeah. We either lose two rosettes or lose or one, one VP. one VP. I had it backwards. Yeah. Which one did you want to do? Man. All right. I guess I will lose one victory point. Stop copying me. <laughs> Are right, you ready for this? So this one goes away, but this one stays. And this one has a rosette on it. So if this one does get completed, that's good. Now, Petter says, I'm really not a Euro guy, but this is interesting. Of course, Dwarven society is utopia, but like every utopia, it needs to be a real, there needs to be a realistic dark side. So it says each commissar, which we're not commissar. We're the factory managers. We didn't put any commissars out. So nobody had a commissar out. You did. You had to pay resources back. Okay. Make sense? Makes sense. And then our new one is, so our new common pool is going to be, ooh, magic. Magic and mushrooms. Magic mushrooms. <laughs> one sure that was one that worker attends the committees. This round is played with one less worker for each factory manager. Wow. Drop them on there. No. <laughs> and then we're going to do <laughs> mushrooms and I'm not happy wood. about that. And then this one would be wood and some steel. All right, all right. All right, Gloria, and get it together. <laughs> you can do this. And these bad boys would just move down. <gasps> They're jumping over. They're leapfrogging. All right, so we've got lots of steam. So I get to go first this time. I'm going to go here. Well, we have shipping. lots of steam. We need to make sure that all of our coal doesn't fall out now, okay? That's the big problem. We don't have any coal oh, in there. Oh, there's... I thought we put two things of coal in there. I'm not Earlier, sure. remember? I'm Go telling you, the coal portion was not good. Okay, I'm playing. 
a place. I'm going to... You're going to be shipping first, huh? Uh-huh. I don't like that business. <laughs> Fine. I will be loading first, I guess. Cool. I'll spike. All right. I will also be shipping. Why are you... <laughs> Why did you give me a little twitchy nose? <laughs> what was that business about? Oh, I see, I see, I see. I'm uh, going to be spiking as well. And we got to make sure we do some accounting up in here. We got to get our accounting on. Oh, this should be switched out. I don't know if I switched that. Oh, yeah, we forgot to switch that. I was just looking at that, too. I was like, oh, my gosh, okay, I may need to do some trading, okay? I may need to do some trading here. <sighs> Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Yeah, I really needed that other worker. I need to do some trading. I needed the other worker, too. Like, I really, I need one more worker to do exactly what I want. Yep, I need exactly one Yeah, more I need too. exactly one more worker to do what I want here. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to get a rosette. Which I'm just like collecting these bad boys like it's nobody's business. Uh, you are. I'm a little jealous by all your rosettes over there. I'm going to give one to myself, right? So what do I want to do here? So it's, there's it needs three marble for that one. And a, is that three marble and a gold? So remember, you do not need to do shipping, loading, spiking every round, especially when you already have a cart in dock. Let's see where you, where you do they ship this round. You know what? I totally get that we don't have to do loading, shipping, and everything, but I also really just like stuff. It's and so true. for me, <laughs> I always want the stuff. <laughs> so I feel like it's like you go into like greedy, greedy gobbles mode where like, you don't need the stuff, but I want the stuff, so I'm going to get the stuff, even though I don't need it. <laughs> and then I'm going to trade the stuff, hopefully, and then it'll work out in the end. We'll see. <gasps> what you doing? What you doing, doctor? Doctor? <laughs> I want you to know what I'm doing. <gasps> Greediness is a virtue in dwarven society. Hoarding resources. See? <laughs> Thank you so much for making me feel better about that. <laughs> okay. I'll put some stuff in there. Okay. I see your stuff. And I say, bureaucracy. <laughs> Curse of bureaucracy? Oh my gosh, that one fell right out of the thing. Right. We just got like a lot of stuff that fell though. Yeah. Like that coal fell out you were talking about. I told you. A bunch of mushrooms came but from out of nowhere. Oh, there's some magic in there. Oh my gosh. Some gold. Oh my gosh. Wood. The thing is, did we get two coals? Like, what? How many coals are coming out here? Okay, so Just the one. All right, so let's go into loading. So you load first. So load up a cart. That <laughs> That's mine. That, that was your bad. Yeah, I was tapping my arm on the table. Okay, so. here's the thing, doctor. If I load this cart, I don't want you to take the cart. How about that? Sure. Sure? Mm -hmm. We can work together. Why do I feel like you're going to take the cart? How about you load it up and let's see how sweet it is. Maybe don't be super greedy and make it super <laughs> awesome. Maybe load both carts with a little bit of something that you want in both. That's called strategy mm -hmm. right there where you're like, hmm, I'll put two in one thing and then two in another thing. So that way, no matter which cart I get, it's good for me. Let's see here. All right, so I think, I think we'll put two of these in here, and I want two more. I want two more things. Two more things. We've and already knocked out two rounds. Yeah, this is round three. What else would be really good? Magic mushrooms. Boop, boop. Magic <laughs> mushrooms. Boop, boop. Is that what you want? You want mushrooms? No, I'm just saying that because that's what came out. Magic mushrooms. Okay, so there's a coal in there. So we're going to go up four. Oh my gosh, how much are we going to go up? Hold on. I may need to load this with like lichens and stuff because it's going to be one, two, and then wood is two each, right? Three, four, five, six. 
right? And then seven, eight, nine, ten with that, right? And then mushrooms. Oh no, oh no. Okay, hold on. The mushrooms are 12, 14, 16. Okay, so there's a problem here. There's a big I just I just shipped my pants. Just take a coal. <laughs> That's three right there. That's oh gosh, this is not gonna be good. Okay, so we're gonna put a coal in there. Okay. And then what else makes the most? It's either the mushrooms wood. or the wood. Yeah. So I think we're gonna put some wood in there as well. Because we need to like make sure we don't go all the way up. Maybe I don't care. Maybe <gasps> I like to watch things burn. How dare you? How dare you? <laughs> Maybe I just want to see the world burn. You don't know. We're at six. I'll be fine. All right, spiking. So we're gonna. The spiking five. is fun. We should probably one of us ends up needing. To, we need to do like the commission thingy here. Oh, that's a lot of coal. Oh, that's a lot of coal. <laughs> hey, doctor, what you doing? Who ships first, me? Yeah, you ship first. <gasps> Are you taking this? Are you taking this? Look at me. Look at me right now. Doctor, no, no, no. You look at me right now, doctor. No. Are you taking my cart? Did you just load up my cart that I just specifically loaded for myself? I don't remember you loading that cart. Did you load that one? Everyone? I am not happy. You seem fine. <laughs> Hello, Steven. How are you doing? Petter's on Team Factory right now. Petter? <laughs> You see that? Not cool. Spiking is fun. Who wouldn't like smuggling? You know what? I'm very upset with you today, doctor. And could you please spike? <laughs> Our fans are eagerly waiting for I'm you to spike. I'm just so upset with you right now. So upset. Put that cue back in there. You better. You better. That's all I wanted. Ugh. Why are you <gasps> freaking out? You wanted a bunch of coal, though, right? Like a whole bunch of coal. It was still a jerk move, but not for the reason you thought. I just was like, here, have some coal. Lots of coal. I hope you want it coal. You're dirty. Cool. <laughs> it's, you're, from all the, it's from all the coal. You're being so mean. I'm not being so mean. <laughs> you're fine. All right, so we've got two, four, six, eight, nine, ten. It still goes up ten. <laughs> like there's nothing we can do. Sixteen, we ruptured. Yeah, so ruptured goes back down to eight, and that's fine. So ruptures at 15, it goes back to 8. And now we can't go past 8, like, ever again. Like, that's it. No. Is it ever again? Or is it just this round? Well, I guess it would probably be ever again, huh? Yeah, I think once it's ruptured, like, it's just dunza. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I knew that was going to happen. It's because all your coal that you keep on putting places. I didn't put any coal in. You need to calm <laughs> you down. You just put some coal in right here. In your cart. That doesn't make this blow up. Well, still, I'm I'm upset by. It. All right, well, be upset. See how that works out for you. All right, so All right six, I'm gonna have seven. some trading. I can get some. Tra I can get my trade on. So, trading wise, what do I want? So here's the from values. Ooh, okay. So I kind of got like everything I wanted though. Then don't trade. It's super easy. I know this is going to really just break your mind. But I could trade in my coal for magic. Can you? I mean, there's a... All resources go to the warehouse. and Let's see here. All resources go to the warehouse. So I can only really do one, though, because I don't have a bunch of room in my warehouse. But it's six-point value trade if I trade in coal. And then it would be six points for magic. I'm trading in one of my coals for magic. I'm going to use some magic here soon. Are you sure that that line doesn't mean you just can't trade for that one this time? Because this one is a one here, saying that if you traded one steel, you traded steel for wool. wool it's a point value wool. here. So, like, if you go ahead and you go ahead and the uh, okay. points to gotcha, and from gotcha. for each one. 
So Why I'm going to turn your coal. I'm not, I'm not giving it to you. I'm showing you my coal. I'm showing you my coal. Okay. I guess. Thank you. <laughs> thank you for, thank you oh, for showing okay, me Okay, so your no coal. coal can go into trading now. There's a ha. sign for coal. Oh, okay. Same apologies, apologies, apologies. Yeah. apologies. Yeah. Okay. So there's no, you can't actually trade in coal. Well, you can still it. buy magic, but you can't trade in. Yeah, but I would have to like spend some other resources in order to get it. Yeah, see, I was going to originally trade in for some steel, but I got the steel that I wanted. Then just... So I, like, just wasted my meeple. Ugh! I could have used that meeple somewhere else. Eight hours later. All right, go ahead. I wasted right, my meeple research, on that one. Then we go to manufacturing. So for manufacturing, I'm going to do the two steel one, I believe. How dare you? Two steel, I'm gonna do this one. Get your steel on. Get my two rosettes. Your turn. What are you gonna do? Oh, you don't have a oh, you don't have nine? I really wish I would have done both of them then. Uh ten. So mm -hmm. go to accounting. I'm gonna spend three to go up four. Cause two I'm also to go gonna up spend three. three to go up four. Alright, so we got nine. Let's go yeah, I wish I would have done both of them, like for sure. And yeah. then I'm going to go ahead and do my second one here. And I'm actually, I'm going to do the heroic statue. Because you know what? I don't know if you know this, but I'm like super fantastical about creating these statues. That's, that's a gold you need for that. What? That's a gold. That's yellow. That's wood. Gold is because it's shiny. You could probably trade for gold, though. So you could have traded for gold. You could have traded for what you need to. Yeah, you need six to get a gold. So trade in. Like two mushrooms or something. Or however you want to do it. Let's see, I don't have two mushrooms. What do I need? I have mostly wood and copper. How much is copper? Three? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, two copper? Two copper. Let's do it. Do you have two copper? I have two copper. All right, get yourself a gold then. All right. I don't know why I keep on trying to give my stuff to you. I don't know. Either. I don't know. So you're gonna, so you're going right, here on this so one. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that one. Yeah. So you'll get this rosette for being a leftover one plus the two rosettes. So thank you. Thank three. you. And we both use steam for that. Yeah, I'm so sorry. We both did use steam. So that's three to six. total. Oh, you're right. Three total. All right. So we did that. So then we would go to. I don't and that's send. You did your manufacturer. So yeah, yeah. send. So return any empty carts, which we don't have any empty carts, right? We completed all of those. So those now are... here's the thing: if I want to do a cart, you can't get one at this point. Well, I I can move this to my man my warehouse, but like I need to open up my warehouse. I need to get a bigger warehouse. Everyone, I need a bigger warehouse. Okay. <laughs> so we both were heroes. <laughs> so we both would have gotten one rosette because we both completed one. So it's six rounds total, and we only have like three more rounds to go. Right, right. Here's the previous card there. What are we putting in for this one? Uh, we're adding one of the that flax. One. Yep, so flax in. And then we need to put in flax, wood, and a coal. Oh, good, coal. <laughs> and then we need to put in another flax, and then we need to put in, yep. A lichen. Yep. Do common pool. Um, so who goes first this time? I think it's you. Yeah, it's you who goes first. At least this I got my people. Okay, so at the end of the round, each commissar is given one copper from the supply. Okay, that's kind of nice. I mean, if you're into bonus, that thing, bonus, if you're into copper. that thing. <laughs> okay, so, so those. So we need epic anvils. We're gonna need a magic, a okay, marble, right. and a, a copper, and a copper, and a steel. Okay. I feel like I, ha I had most of that from last round, but now I do not. And then the other one here, what does this one here do? It's whiskey tonight, so probably shorter. <laughs> so uh, this one two here is and then any metals. two wood and then any two types of metals. Hmm. I just got rid of my copper, dang it. Ooh, these ones are tough. These ones are going to be tough just overall to complete. I don't see me completing these in this round, honestly. 
All right, go ahead and place. We're definitely going to do some loading. Oh, switch the market out, right? Oh, yeah. So sorry. Yeah, because I feel like I'm going to need the market this round. <laughs> feel like I'm going to need some marketing this round. <gasps> or if you have people with analysis paralysis, then no one can say how long. Well, you know. You call I her. have analysis paralysis a lot of times. That's true. Whenever I'm streaming, I always try to kind of pick up the speed a little bit. But I do take a little bit something. more time to take my turn. <laughs> All right. Go ahead and place. I did. Place again. I went to loading. Oh, my gosh. You already placed? It only takes Holy a second. Holy cowbells. Okay, I'm going to do the shippings. I'm going to do this accounting before you take up all the accounting. Are you trying to get ahead in points right now, doctor? I'm literally going to get ahead in oh, points. Oh, gosh. All right, we're going to do the trading. I feel like I'm going to waste one of my people again this turn. You're going to do all the things, all the manufacturing, huh? I also need to do manufacturing, like, real bad. All right. Your turn, Doctor. You got this. You got this. What changes? One meeple less per a player whenever you're playing the different player counts on that. All right. There you go. Just in case. Because I haven't figured all this out yet. <laughs> but I want to hold everybody up forever. You haven't figured out so everything you want to do. Okay. You get a rosette. Oh, <gasps> no. Where was I at? I was tied with you, right? Pretty sure. Those rosettes, getting this every single time has given you... A lot of rosettes to use. We definitely need some coal. No. And then a random wood. Why are you loading up all that coal, coal, doctor? That's not coal. Coal? All the coal? No. I don't care. No. I don't care what you no. want. No. I don't care what you want. That's why. All right, bureaucracy. Oh, good. All the coal fell out. <laughs> I hope that's what you wanted. All right, go ahead and load, spike, and then ship. Yeah, I feel like... Timo, I feel like I had to go ahead and play through this game one time in order to kind of really see how everything moved around in this game because there are so many different ways to change things and change, like, how you're getting and resolving your materials and stuff in this game that absolutely I had to play through the whole game to be like, oh, okay, I think I know what I want to do during this and kind of how to manipulate it a little bit better. All right, so what am I doing? You're loading. I'm loading, okay. I don't want any of these things. Why did you give me such... Oh, no, wait. I want these. I think. I already have steel. Just kidding. I don't want those things. Wood and steel over there. What is over there? A steel, a copper, a marble, and a magic. All right. Let's take a steel. Let's take a... You know, like, yeah, let's take a steel. And... Just take some stuff. You don't want any of us. Just take it. How dare you. You don't know what I want. This is what Timo's talking about. <laughs> okay. You're letting there you Timo go. down. <laughs> what is this? That's from the spiking. You literally didn't want to do this stuff. This is all I'm doing. I'm doing all these things. These are good. Uh, well, I want this need, magic. You need all this stuff, apparently. I do want... I need all this stuff. I stand by myself needing all this stuff. I stand by. Okay. Put and I'll take flax. Okay. Get in there. All right, now ship it to yourself. Done. Okay. Now we go to 16 <laughs> generation. We're going to go ahead and burn this steam right here. So we're going to get two, three, four, five. All this gets burned, actually. Burn, um, baby burn. Which we can only go up to eight, you said. So yeah. we max out of eight. So right here at the, the bottom portion of these, they're going to show you what burns as it goes along. Yeah. So, that's, uh, so that was... Steam, so six. Then we go to seven, trading. Do you want to do any trading? I believe I do need to do some trading. Okay, so... Now I need to figure out what the crap I'm going to be doing. 
got two of those. I got those. So I got that covered there. Then over here, we need a steel. I need a copper, a marble, and a magic. So a copper and a marble is what I'm looking for. Do, do, do. So that would be... It's going to cost me six for those. Yikes. So we're going to turn in a lot of coal. Maybe. Come here. I need a copper and a marble. All right. Oh, dang, I don't have room in my stuff. I'm going to have to, like, get rid of some stuff. Oh, my gosh, this could be a problem. What can I trade this beer in for? The beer trades for four? That sucks. Ah, oh, I just lost stuff. So the beer trades in for four. How much does the copper cost? Oh, the copper, copper uh, is going to be six on that. So I got two left over. And I can buy steel cost. So let's see here. My dad's 70 years Plus, with no gamer background, learned it on the first attempt, had never played any worker placements. Everything is really clearly written on the board. So as you're going through, I mean, everything's labeled. Like, here's the zero part here where you go ahead and start and you flip over a card. Then here's the one spot and this is how you resolve it. And here's like the little prices of everything, you know. Then you go to step two, which is bureaucracy and putting it in the tower. So like everything, I, I love how everything is on the boards here. And it makes the game flow very quickly, so you're not always having to consult anything. Like, that makes it really super simple, Petter. I can't imagine my parents learning this, but my dad would probably destroy everyone. <laughs> That's gone, I think. All right. And then I need... I got the two wood for that. I don't need that. And then two of any other random... Seven. Resource. Are you still doing your trading? Yeah. Okay. Okay. I can do this. I believe I can do this. Uh, so to go into research, I don't actually think I'm going to research. Really? Yeah. You specifically, I thought you were going to get a warehouse. I was for sure you were going to get a warehouse. I don't know if I have I all wanna, the materials yeah, for it. I'm overwhelmed by the amount of stuff I need to do. So I uh -oh. just don't want to mess okay, with okay, that. Okay, okay, okay. It's fine. Uh, so nine. So you're actually going first, correct? Yes. Doesn't matter. There's no rosettes there. So from dock one here, I here. can do one magic. And I can do the copper. Ooh, I wonder if we're gonna like run out of steam with this. So I'm doing the storage boxes right here. I'm doing epic anvils. So it's two steam, two steam. Yep. One, two, three, four. So I did this one, so I get four rosettes. And I need two rosettes, please. Okay, so that's nine, and then we can switch now for that one. I need to have two wood, so that's one wood, that's two wood, and then just two of any other random thing. Okay. Well, now we do accounting. All right, so for accounting, I'm going to turn in three to get, uh, I'm sorry, two to get three victory points. It's going to give me one, two, and then I'm going to trade in um, one to get another victory point, right? So yeah. Three, oh, sorry. Three, four. So I should be getting four. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do the same thing again. I'm going to trade in three more rosettes and get four more. <laughs> this is not one, good. One, two, three, four. So I'm at 21. This is not good. I All right. I'm also going to turn left, in my so. three to go up four. One, two, three, four. I have like five more rosettes still. Too. Now I'm going to do the other manufacturing portion here in which I'm going to make the epic anvils as well. Right, right. And same thing here. I'm going to do wood, wood. I'm going to trade in my gold and some steel for the other one, but I'm going to do the, no. the optimal. Are you doing yeah. the optimal? Optimal. Wow. So at least we got that Listen, going I had all us. the stuff. You know why? I'm going, to I'm going to tell you a secret why I had all the stuff. Because you should Because shipped. I always take all the stuff. <laughs> I always take all the stuff, so I had all the stuff I needed. <laughs> Completely. Oh, and you're completing both of your cars, getting them out of there, huh? I'm only doing the one. We're putting the one back. 
So we would have both gotten our hero because we both completed both of them. Oh, did we go down with our steam? Yeah, we're at for zero. The, we're at zero now. Woo! Yep. All right. So empty cards back. We completed all you of You just these. like jutted out way ahead of me. Just by four points. You say just by four points, but that four points is quite a bit in this game. <laughs> I'm not happy about that. Now I actually need stuff. Oh, you need stuff too. Why don't you give it to your last cart? You just move into your warehouse. Because then if I want to get something from here, like I can't go ahead and get something from there. Oh, I see. So these go away. Yep, yep. Okay, so let's go away. New, new ones, ones, new ones. New market. Oh, at the end of each round, each commissar is given a Which copper from nobody, supply. Nobody commissar. And then... Motivation Committee grants the factory manager with at least rosette and immediate beer. beer. Where are you going to put that beer? Oh, luckily you have a ha -ha! See, that's exactly why. <laughs> why are you giving it to me? What? That's you. Oh. I have the most rosettes by far. Well, how many do you have? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? Do I have eight? I have eight. Six, seven, eight. You have eight? Yeah. Oh, well, then nobody gets it. Oh, nobody I thought we both it. get it. No, I think nobody gets Rude. it. I don't want you to have beer. <laughs> All right, so our new common pool is going to be, we need a steel in here. Here we go. Steel, wood. We got a flax, a beer, and Where are you getting the beer wood. from? Right? Is that beer? No, is I that think beer? that's coal. Is it? No, it's beer. Ha ha. Sucker. <laughs> and then what do we get? For, did you already put the one for I already him? put that one in there, yeah. Okay, so that's our new common pool. This is our, we only have this round and one more round left, and that's it. Like, all done. All done. So I feel like this is so intense here for this last round. It's so intense. All right, that's a lot of stuff that you need for these things. Holy cow battles. We're going to go down in points. Well, well, well. Yikes. Okay. Then... You know what? I'm going to take this. We're going to do that there. We're going to do that there. You're going to do double shipping? Mm-hmm. And then he's going to do double shipping, everyone. I see. I see. I'm not happy about that. Sure. I guess I'm going to do some loading. I'm going to help you out. I'm going to help you sh load up your stuff, doctor. How about, how about that? Would you like my help? Sure. I'm going to be really, really good at loading. Like, really good. Here we go. Again? Oh, you already placed? Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Um, let's see here. I think we're gonna try this, maybe? Oh, I'm so nervous. I know I'm not gonna be able to do that one. I have a steel. Steel, a wood, and some sort of metal. Right? You need... This one says you need five. Wow. Yeah, five. I'm like, uh, that's not happening. Five wood. Well, I mean, you can do the, the lesser tanks. one, though. You can just do two metals, a wood. And I don't then... have any metals. That's the big problem. <laughs> and, then, and then any other material. That's the big problem. I don't have any metal. We're going to try some trading. Yeah, because that's wood, and then a steel, and then an, any type of metal. And we need to change out the market card. I already did. Oh, okay, good. <gasps> what are you doing? Here we go. You're trying to, sh you're shipping all the shipping things to yourself, huh? <laughs> It'll make your decisions easier because you'll have like no options. I'm being helpful. Are you? I you think still so. have to load up. This is the interesting part right here. You still have to load that up. Mm -hmm. How many resources do you think are in that tower right now? 
Go ahead and place your last one. I'm definitely going to put this here so I can load up some resources for you. I'm going to be the healthier, like the helpingest person ever for you. I'm going to help you so much right now. <laughs> You're like straight to treating. <laughs> right. Go ahead. You're going to go here. <laughs> Hopefully we'll see if All something right, happens. All right, so you give yourself, you've got up to total of, you've got a one and then a two for yourself. <laughs> so give yourself your stuff. All right. We're going we're gonna to take a steal from myself. <laughs> oh my goodness and you know what? i'll just do both of them at the same time i'm gonna take a wood as well there okay and then for this here i have a whole lot of stuff and i'm going to help you fill it up i don't even care fill it up with whatever you want okay i think that in the long run you're pretty hungry so i feel like you may need sure like some mushrooms mm -hmm. so that's like four five six give me some steam steam it up six i'm trying i'm trying to get a steamy up in here okay so that's four five six oh, i still need another six of them you know what i think we're going all in mushrooms and lichens there you go i still get to load one myself so i don't really Let's make sure one of them is good. <laughs> Mushroom and lichens for everybody. And beer. <laughs> Can I just burn my mushrooms like they're wood? Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. My dog is just dying over here. He just rolled over on his back. Oh, no. I knocked my guy over. Let's see. Or blocking someone else's shipping. How to take, how much take that is there? Well, you're going to see. You're going to see exactly right now. It's it's a very back ways of doing it, really, Petter. So I can load right, up four, right? so I did that. Four, right? We did two. Yep. So you can load up four. So what do I want? So that one wants wood. This one wants metals. That one wants metals. I'll take two metals just to be on the safe side. I mean, I'll get that one no matter what. And I'll take a beer and a wood. A beer and a wood? Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm also going to help you load. Thank so you. So I feel like you need mushrooms and lichens. Mm -hmm. And I guess you'll take this one. Well, I can, I can technically load as one to four. Mm -hmm. You can just load one if you want. I think I might because we do need some steam, right? So that's two, four... Five, and these are flax six seven so i think i want to give you a flax in there okay i know you need that beep 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 <laughs> yeah see tim is tim is right up there he's like you can load just the one Four, just the one five you get all the shippings See, I told you I was being very, very helpful. You need to be extra nice. <laughs> Six, okay. So that's done. Famous last words. I'm going to get it in the next round, maybe. Um, six. I'm not, like, mad. So go ahead and do any trading you want to do. Okay. So trading-wise, what do I need here? I want to be able to see these better. Because I'm definitely going to be able to do one of them. Just which one? So I've I got some metals. This. I have steel. I got... The wood. Metal, wood. Metal's wood. Okay, I got that there. The other one is just crazy. Like, I do not have enough wood for all that. So, flax is going to be like a one. But you can't get flax or wood. This is like a super heavy one with wood and metal here. And that's just not going to happen. Jeez, jeez, I could trade in my coal and I could get some copper, I guess. What is this one? What is this one right here? Let's see here. 
Oh, but I don't have enough room to put anything in there. I don't have enough. I don't have enough storage. I can't do anything. Ah, okay. I don't think I can do anything because I want to trade in my flax for wood. And right now you can't get wood. And then I would want to trade in my coal to get wood, but I can't because I don't have space to actually do that. What is beer worth now? Four? Is that correct? I believe you're converting it to, or no, yeah, from to two, yeah. Okay, so beer's worth four, mushrooms are worth four? Yeah. I'm gonna trade in this eight then. Oh, what are you gonna get? We get magic for one. <gasps> And then... Oh my gosh. The game offers no limits for negotiation except that no resources can be traded directly. So whatever you trade is essentially favors. I load a nice cart for you, then you ship something for me. Place workers to requisitions and I'll promise to add the gold to your cart for loading. So you say. So you say. You can get, you can get wood. <laughs> I can't trade my flax in for wood because I have a flax. Oh, okay. My thing was I wanted to trade in my coal and then I was going to get wood because like it costs three to five wood over there for that and I just can't do that because I don't have like the storage for it. I need like three wood. So I just don't have storage. Okay. You can take those. We're done with that. All right, so that's seven. We go to eight. Uh, nobody did any upgrades. Nine. Are you on nine? You're on the no, other I'm one. No, I'm on right? the other one. So I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the one where I need steel. Right. So steel is. What color is steel? Oh, steel is gray. Where's my steel is gray. It's like the really go? super blue. Do I not have gray? No, I loaded it up with lichens and mushrooms. Remember? I thought I had a gray though specifically. Did I just trade in a gray? No, because I traded in a mushroom and beer. Oh, I need to trade for gray then. I should have traded for gray. You can go ahead and do whatever you were going to do. I think I got the colors confused. The steel. Oh, I can't trade to steel right now. There is no steel available. Well, instead of the magic, I would have had five. Give me back uh, the beer, please. All right, there you go. And then give me one more wood. There you go. I don't know what I was doing. It was somewhere in here. I need five and then a random metal. Do I have a random metal though? I don't even have a random yeah, metal. Yeah, that's the this one is hard. This one's tough. Carts only get more resources in loading or spiking, never from trading. Yeah. Oh, so I, did I mess up my trading then? Yeah, whenever you trade, you have to put it into your Warehouses? Warehouses when you're trading. Oh, I really that was my big in. thing for me because I wanted to trade in my coal and I don't I have room I for it. I think I thought this one of these was a gray because of the way our white Probably lights are. Probably because of our white light, yeah. Right. So I've already messed all this up, so I'm just going to skip it. Okay, just... okay. Okay. And then what do we have next? So nine and then... Doo -doo -doo. That's my fault anyways. I I thought one of these was gray. I, I don't... That's the only thing about this really bright white light in front mm -hmm. of us is white stuff like that looks like that color. So now we go ahead and do the counting. Yeah, I'm going to trade in, was it the three? And go up four. And go up one, two, three, four. And you're going to do the same thing, right? One, but twice. Two, three, four, one, two, three, four. But twice. Yeah, we're just tied at 25. All, All right. right. Can you actually complete one of the goals? I think I can complete a goal. Okay. So I have steels and wood for the buckets. I can make the buckets. Oops. And go down one steam. Did you do the optimal? I did the optimal. I think that's going to make it so you win right there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Because me not being able to complete one because I, mess, I messed up my trading in here. Yeah. I could have. I thought I had a steal the whole time. That's the only reason why I went for it. I didn't need a steal. I thought I had one on me. All right. And then that is that one. Mm-hmm. And then we each have to either lose two rosettes or lose a victory point. I'm going to lose one victory point. Yeah, I think we both will. We both go to 24. But I still get a rosette for having yep. 
Yeah, is that you completed got, order? That's what I'm saying. That really messed me up because you're going to get three rosettes and I didn't get any this time. <gasps> Last round. Oh, wait. I wanted to put this in my storage and we'll put my cart back up there. What is, so what does this one say? That game ends after this round. So there's nothing additional that goes in from that one. So yeah, game ends, ends after here. this round. Accounting costs a rosette for each worker payable at the time of placing the worker which is like an extra added thing. So whenever you go to accounting here, you have to place a rosette in order to place a worker. And then end scoring, so every three is going, every three rosettes is going to give you one victory point. The most resources is going to give you one. The most standard improvements will give you one most. And then some of these, uh, like the invention cards and stuff like that, commission cards, we didn't do it for the advanced game. So right. we'll skip over those ones there. But yes, this is the final round. It's the final countdown. Do, do, do. All right. I don't remember who goes first. Who goes first? Did you trade off the market card? I think. All right. Let's load up our stuff here. So, I went so one, we have one. I'm on odds. Steel. So it should be you. Or did you already put the yep, steel in here? In okay, perfect. I'm on so odds. It's so me? it should be you. Yeah. Because I did one, three, and five. Gosh. It's like, what can we make? There's something for flax and some other stuff out there. So let's do a shipping for me. Go ahead. We'll do a loading. That is going to be tough. We're going to put one here as well. That's going to be crazy. It's like, do you want to sacrifice? Oh, he did it. Can't believe you did that. <laughs> I can't believe you did that. My turn. Uh, what do you got? One, two, three, four. And I have one, two, three for now. Oh, this final round is like crazy. Let me do that. This is a close game. Is that the last one? That's my last one. And trading. Oh, that's right, because Doctor has a whole bunch of stuff already. You already have a bunch of resources to kind of do stuff with. Can you make that steam tank? You probably can, can't you? What does the steam tank need? It's five. Uh, five wood. It's five and wood then and then a random metal. resource. Yeah. A random metal one. The other one's metal and then two flax. The thing is, sucks. I could probably make both, but I need like another worker back. All right, so requisitions. Go ahead and do your requisitions, doctor. What are you doing? What are you doing with all that steel? What are you doing right now? I can't, I can't take anything into my own. <laughs> I can't take anything into my own. That was quite a bit of steel you just put in there, doctor. Wow, I feel like you're specifically trying to bank for something there. Trying to get yourself some steel? You could just take your time. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Okay, so wood costs two each. So two, four, six for that there. And then one for seven. So we'll put a flax in there. I think flax is one, right? Yeah, flax is one. And then... I take two points worth, which I think I might take a wood. Did I get my rosette for going there? I didn't yet, did I? I don't know what you got. I don't know. I don't think I did. So that goes in there, and then... Oh, man. 
Okay, and then that's a lot of metal. We also need flax. All right, so six, so two, and then four, and how much was the steel? Five, six. We'll also do that. All right, there we go. Bureaucracy! I don't think I can actually do what I want to do. Also note that they played without using the commissary locations. Hexagons are the overseers on every action having a unique effect. Yeah. We used, Doctor used it uh, for, ship, for shipping at one point here. And it does, it changes kind of what's going on in each square. So like you ended up where you could ship both carts, right? Yeah, I was afraid you were going to go there and then like take and the then take spot. what yeah, yeah, take what you wanted. So you decided to do it and then choose to go ahead and ship yeah, both carts. But I, yeah, but I definitely didn't play ultimate op optimally because I, I've already messed up something else, I think, too. Not good. Uh, loading, you. Okay. And spiking is you. Okay. Loading wise. I'm not going to be able to do all the things I want. <laughs> all right. So I want to make sure I'm loading the right things. These are all gray cubes, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. We're going to put those in there and we're going to put I already have one of those I have one of those so yeah I think I'm just maybe going to go all in with that Put that there and we're going to do the spiking and so these here we're going to put these in here like so it doesn't matter to refill that one up right now Shipping. Ship to yourself. And I'm gonna ship this to myself. I'm gonna ship this one here and have it blow up. Oh gosh! Look at it. the tr the trim just fell off. <laughs> it just blew right up. <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I hope they don't want that back. <laughs> all right. This is what happens when you get all willy nilly in this here. Is six steam burst goes up to eight. You said because we're gonna burn a whole bunch. Yeah, we burned. We burned so many things. Oh my that god! Coal gets burned. Oh that gets burned. That gets burned. That gets burned. Lightning gets burned. So trading for you. That gets burned. All right. So for trading, I need to have this flax. So I'm sorry. How much does it? So the flax works. So it, it turns into two. Yes. This is two, and then a steel is also a two. So I'm gonna trade that straight up for steel, which I'll just grab the steel from here. There, and then this lichen. Is a two for two trade also. So I'm going to actually trade those two for two steel. You're getting all the trades done. So let's see here. I can't trade. Yeah, so that's interesting. So like, I, since I can't trade from my cart, like my cart's just sitting with stuff in it. Like I want to trade with it too, but I just can't. Okay, so I did that. So trading is done. So we go to eight, which I have an eight. So I'm going to go ahead and spend these two resources here to and two steam to build the small warehouse. So now Very I nice. could move, say, like, I don't know, those in there. But it's too late to even trade now. So I'll move those down there for whatever reason. Okay. So so I did that. I'll put these in the warehouse also just to look cool. Okay, now I think it's production time, right? Or manufacturing time? Yeah, it's manufacturing time. So I'm able to, are you able to do one? Yes. Which one are you doing? Steam tanks or the grappling hooks? I get to go first? Mm hmm Oh, man. Okay, so if I do the steam tanks, Like, no, I can't do the steam tanks. I don't have the wood for it. Okay. So, so I'm going to do the grappling hooks. I'll do I'm the doing the grappling hooks. hooks. We'll Dang it. That makes Dang it. it. I wanted that other rosette so bad. <laughs> it just wasn't going to work out. Get over there, you. 
All right, so we're taking this stuff right here. I need my two rosettes, please. There you go. Thank you, thank you. Okay, two rosettes. Um, and then, why am I like losing track of everything now? Uh, 10. So I'm going to trade in two. So it's, what? what is it? At the very end, it says each three rosette equals one thing and then most resources, which, okay. The end points are very, very tiny, like increments. Right, right. But you have five resources right now, so I'm not going to have the most end game points there. So it makes sense to trade in two, two, and a beer. So I'm going to do a trade in these two and a beer. So that's going to give me three, four. One, two, three, four. I'm going to trade in three rosettes for my four. And then I'm going to do two rosettes here and get another three one two three because this will give me a four here and you also get one more from yours but you also get most resources so i think we're getting pretty close here all right so that's uh that's nine that's ten i wish i would have had like i wish i could have I made that been, one extra yeah, one i couldn't do any more trading so ten uh I did, we, oh, we did ten eleven one. you don't have eleven so then we go to twelve end of operations mm -hmm. so we both actually get a oh we both get a rosette so actually i could trade in one more to get in that one extra point and we both get a rosette for being heroes. We both did one. And we go to this end of round now, which is each three gives you one. So I'm going to turn in three to get one more. I'm going to turn in three to get one more. Okay. And then most resources, you have the most resources. Yep. And then most standard improvements, I have the most standard improvements. Because I have a Yeah, because you end up getting your warehouse. Yeah, at the very, very end. And that's it, right? Man, I... <laughs> 34 Doctor, to 30. That was close. I wish I could have gotten in on accounting. If I would have gotten in on accounting, yeah. I would have won this game. Oh, yeah. Yeah. If I would have just... Or, like, if I would have... No. You would, if you would have taken it first. If I would have taken it first, yeah. Then I would have gone second, and then you would have got the third one there. But you didn't take it first. You let me take it first. Dang it! <laughs> close one. That was a close one, baby. Oh my gosh. So, yes, the expansion brings in Elven Commissions, essentially yeah. an alternative secret set of manufacturing things. There's lots of... I'm sweating like a dwarf now. I feel like I gained, I gained like five chest hairs by the end of the scoring. There's... I was like, it's like... Bling, 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 bling. Well, keep in mind, everybody, we only played the base version of this yeah, game. Yeah, there, there's is, more to it. Yeah, this is just the basic version as you're and you playing. you can get really crazy with multiple people. Like, we played it with our daughter, actually. And yeah. And then somebody going here. Which, so, like, I placed here, and then my wife... So, I'm so sorry, I flipped down. So, we played it earlier with my daughter, right? And so, it was like this. So, I was going to I was gonna ship, and then my wife's going to ship. And then my daughter comes in with just say she's this purple cube, and she goes, Boom! Actually, I'm going to have mom ship and both of them. And then it turned into this. And I was this, like, no. So then they hey. both got stuff, and I didn't get anything that round. Well, then it turned into a negotiation portion at yeah. that point. Because then we're negotia negotiating with the other person and going, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yeah. I'm going to be the best person to ship this out because I can ship your stuff, and I can ship my stuff. And the commission portions of this completely change each individual area and it works really really great when you have that i think that one extra person involved when they're doing the commission portion it, on that it can make it very tricky for sure it really really can we were so, mostly we did pretty good where we weren't like too combative with each other there was that one time that we, one time right through a bunch of coal <laughs> that, that one time back in that one happened. time in the one day it just ha i don't even remember what happened <laughs> something just happened and she got attacked, and I don't really remember who it was. It could have been anybody, honestly. Absolutely. So I feel like the more players that you end up having in this, which this goes from two to four players, yeah. that the you're going to get a lot of extra player interaction with the more players, obviously, because you have more players. But here, but let me help top, you. No, just take the very top, top, top. Well, the funnel. Take the funnel off. Then it'll take away all the shadow. Take I was just going to tip it off. so they can see. Well. So, of course, this is a prototype here, but you uh, can see whenever you start dropping cubes down in here, there are certain places here where you can end up catching it, okay? Which we had. Oh, my gosh, all my steel was in there. <laughs> was it? There was three steel, <laughs> a mushroom, some wood. Come on. Come on. Now, this is obviously the prototype, but that's essentially how the tower works. So, it's kind of cool that you've got 
all kinds of crazy different, and that's okay, all kinds of crazy different holes that'll catch stuff in different ways. Yeah, I that's like a that. really cool feature of it. I really like so that So sometimes feature. you have to over prime it and just dump in a whole mm -hmm. bunch and be like, okay, I'm going to put in like 1,500 You're like, steel. my stuff will come down and the steel to the end. <laughs> and they did not listen to me. Bureaucracy, dang it. Yeah, because well, it, gets, it gets held up by red tape. So it's very on, <laughs> it's very on theme. Make sure that you go ahead and check out the link for the Kickstarter in the description below, everyone, because then you can see the final production looking thing of this. Because like we said, you know, this is just a pre-production copy. And so it has functionality, but it doesn't look nice and pretty like the one on the Kickstarter does, okay? <laughs> and if you if you like checking out uh, new Kickstarters, why they are um, why the campaigns are active, definitely like and subscribe to Game Boy Geek. Absolutely, absolutely. Thank you so much for everybody who joined us today. We will be back later this week with Hot Potato for the Game Boy Geeks channel, so I'm excited to play that. <laughs> Other than that, we will see all of you later. Thank you. Bye. Bye.